Hey, my name is Sean and I'm a technical marketing manager here at Red Hat. For this video, I'm going to do a demonstration and overview of Private Automation Hub. Let's get started. Access to Automation Hub, including both the hosted service on cloud.redhat.com and the self-hosted Private Automation Hub that can be installed and maintained on your own infrastructure, are both included in your Red Hat Ansible Automation Platform subscription. Before I dive into Private Automation Hub, I want to summarize Ansible Collections really quickly. Ansible content resides outside of the Ansible distribution in a standardized format called Collections. Delivery of high-quality Ansible content can be made available on demand and asynchronously, separate from Ansible Automation Platform releases. Collections are divided into three major categories. There are Ansible Collections that are shared publicly on Ansible Galaxy. Ansible Galaxy is our upstream, and all content found here is considered community. Everything is public on Ansible Galaxy, and anyone can publish to or download content from here. Automation Hub on cloud.redhat.com is our certified content from Red Hat and our partners. Everything on cloud.redhat.com is fully supported with your Red Hat Ansible Automation Platform subscription. Private Automation Hub is a supported, on-premises option for our customers. This is also fully supported with your subscription. This allows enterprises to create content and share it internally without it being in the community or on Automation Hub. Let's go ahead and log in and look around. The look and feel is very similar to Automation Hub on cloud.redhat.com. Collections are shown as cards, or the view can be changed to show a more compact list. In the top left corner, we can see a drop down to sort the different types of collections. Publish refers to private collections that have been approved for use within my organization. The word publish means that they are available for Ansible automation engineers to start downloading from this instance. Red Hat Certified includes content from cloud.redhat.com that has been approved for use and synced locally. Finally, Ansible Community refers to content synced from Ansible Galaxy. The namespaces link shows a read-only mode for all users of all available namespaces and their corresponding collections for this private automation hub instance. Everyone has read access to the published and synced namespaces. I'm switching to a brand new private automation hub instance with no content in it. I can quickly create a private namespace, assign owners, and upload content. A namespace is a section or grouping that can contain multiple Ansible collections. For this demonstration, I already have a collection I created on my laptop. I can select the tar.gc file, the standard format for Ansible collections, and press the upload button. The collection will begin uploading and provide output in the console window. You can see here the namespace is Sean underscore namespace and the collection is product underscore demos. The output provides information on which piece of content, such as a role, is being loaded and what tests are being performed, in this case ansible-lint. When the collection is finished uploading, it will tell you it is complete and provide a green done indication. We can now see the Sean namespace it created under my namespaces. Let's go ahead and create another namespace to see what that will look like. I am naming this namespace video demo because I made it specifically for you. I hope you will enjoy this amazing namespace. Again, this namespace is empty. I'm going to upload another Ansible collection called Hello Collection. Yeah, it's a play on Hello World. This collection is a bit smaller than the other one, so there's only a couple things to test in Lint. You can see warnings with this yellow text. This collection is missing documentation, so it's letting me know that it's not up to the high standards of Red Hat certified content. Now when I click my namespaces, I have two separate namespaces, each of them with one collection each. I'm going to go ahead and click the approval link on the left menu. Both of my collections were automatically approved. Nothing is currently staged. I can remove the staging filter to see that they were approved. I can also reject them right here by clicking the ellipsis menu. Automatic approvals versus manual approvals is a configuration setting we can change. Finally, I want to show how we can load in content from Ansible Galaxy or Automation Hub. Here's a requirements file that I have. I want to load in three collections from Ansible Galaxy. The Amazon collection, the Juniper Networks collection, and the F5 Networks collection. Notice I can also pin a specific version of a collection. Under repo management, I can configure my remote repositories such as Ansible Galaxy and Automation Hub. Clicking the ellipsis menu, I can load my YAML requirements file right here. Pressing the sync button will automatically sync just those three specific collections. Now that that process is completed, I can see those collections under community listings and make them available to all my Ansible Automation Platform clusters. 
I just used the drop down menu to select community and I can see the Amazon, Juniper, and F5 collections right here. Now I want to show Automation Hub, but I'm going to need a token. If I go to cloud.redhat.com, I can grab an API token to use with Private Automation Hub. The exact link is cloud.redhat.com slash ansible slash automation hub slash token, as you can see on your screen. We will go ahead and copy this token to our clipboard. Please don't steal other people's tokens. That is mean. Copy the token to the Red Hat Certified Remote and paste it in. When you press sync, Automation Hub will sync all Red Hat Certified and supported content to your private Automation Hub. Now all certified content shows up under the Red Hat Certified drop-down menu. Thank you for watching this video. For more information on Ansible and Automation Hub, please visit ansible.com.